In both video, we're going to draw this brush holder that we are seeing in front of us. First, we're going to have a look at the sizes or the dimensions, and as we can see, they are all in inches, right? And then we're gonna come back to Inventor. Once we here, we're gonna click on New thing, all right? Then we go English Standards Inches, and then we say Create. Don't worry about that. Then we'll click on Sketch. I'm gonna start with the lines. I click my drawing plane as Y is it? Okay. So here is my line, my first one. So it's gonna go like that. So like that. I go like this. I go like that. I go like this. Mm -hmm. This is just the frame, right? Then from there, we're gonna pick up the pieces and uh, make sure that everything is correct or fine. So I want this one here to be uh, 0 0.5 inches, so half an inch, you know, half an inch, and uh, this one as well, come on, this one as well need to be half an inch, so half an inch, and uh, from the to the, that need to be 90 degrees, which is fine, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that this one is parallel to that one, Okay, it is. That one needs to be parallel to that one. Great. And those need to be parallel to that one. Alright, that's correct. So then from the up to the that one needs to be half an inch as well. Okay. Fine. So once that's in place, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give the sizes now. So from the up to here, that one needs to be six point five. Five, six, one, three inches. Okay, so that's correct. Okay, and then from V up to V, that's one gonna be two point three seven five inches. Okay, don't worry about that. Everything gonna be fine. <laughs> uh, this one gonna be three. 0.75 inches correct and I need to make sure about from the to the that's one need to be 120 degrees great okay so the shape is coming you know, as I said we're gonna you know pick up from where we left it so from there up to here that's one need to be 2.07 which is correct so don't have to worry about that and uh I think that's it. So I have that dimension there. I have that one over there. Okay. So once that the frame is there, what you're gonna do is we're gonna go on 3D model. We say is we're gonna extrude it by uh, let's go. So 1.875 inches. Let's say okay. So once that's in there, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have gonna have to draw the slots that we see here okay that's one and that's and those holes thing okay then we come here I say new sketch there you go and uh, there's my slot so I come here I say you need to go like that okay then from the up to here, that one need to be 1.625 inches. Okay, and uh, from the up to the that one need to be 0 0.5628. Is it 28? No, 26. Okay, and from the to here. That one need to be one inch. Okay. That need to be one inch, and I need to make sure that uh, this one is at the center. So that one need to be um, zero point nine three seven five. Great. Okay. Then I say finish sketch. Then I come this side again. I say. New sketch. 
Okay. So here I'm gonna draw those two holes. Okay. So I'll start. I say that one and that one. Now I want from the to the to be 0 0.9375 inches. Okay. And from the up to the it need to be the same so 0 0.9375 inches okay and thus need to be um, 1.0625 inches and the other one need to be 0 0.625 inches. Great. Then I'm gonna say 3D model. Okay, it's extrude. So I'm gonna extrude this part here. That part. That's it. Then I'm gonna cut it. So it's gonna go like that. It's just go both sides of the of the drawing plane. So like that, and then I'm gonna say okay. So I count the side as well. 3D model, extrude. So I need to cut that part over the both sides like that. Great. Okay. I'll come here and say visibility on. Extrude again. Then I'm gonna punch that part there. It needs to be extruded inside. So the other side by zero point out. 0 0.25 0 0.25 like that okay great then i say okay i come here i say visibility off visibility off then i need to kill this corner that corner and which one and this one And that's one. Okay, I click on fill it. Then here I will put 0 0.9375. Okay, then there we go. I see. Okay, so now here is your brush holder. So the next touch you now you need to consider maybe is to give you the material so you can go for steel alloy if you want to so yeah we're gonna come here then yeah, i say steel alloy this is how it looks like or else <laughs> you can go for gold you know gold gold is shiny and uh you know all the procedures come over it so i prefer gold so there you go so it was a pleasure of mine sharing this video with you. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you're going to enjoy it for now. I'm going to ask you to take care of yourself and see you on the next video. So please, if you haven't subscribed and this is your first time to be here, please subscribe. I don't want you to miss the next video. So take care of yourself and bye.